Now, as far as camera is concerned, the camera interface has been improved this time. This is much easier to toggle in between the photo and the video mode now. And then we have quick toggles over there. You can actually enable the HDR auto and it is right now enabled uh, as we can see. And we have the option to control the flash. You can also set the timer. Over there, if you tap on these three lines, you can access more modes, which include the photo sphere mode, panorama mode, lens blur mode, and you also have access to quick settings. And let me just do that again. So here we have the settings in which you can control the resolution. It is going to take photos at 12.2 megapixels at 4 to 3 aspect ratio. The front camera is 5 megapixel. The back camera video recording is at 100p. The front camera can record video at 100p, but we are not sure about the frames per second. We will confirm that later. As far as the camera interface is concerned, the quality is concerned, I can show you some of the camera samples. In order to access the camera samples, now you need to tap here uh, rather than swiping. And this is how you can toggle in between the front and the rear camera like this hello and let me show you some of the photos which we have captured from the rear camera so this is one of the photos which i have captured from the rear camera which is looking nice all these photos have been captured in low light scenario right now and they are looking good i would say in terms of the uh, colors i was expecting in terms of the details i was expecting everything is looking good and even if you double tap and take a look over the details the details are nicely captured in this low light scenario in daylight you will get better performance this is one shot which is against light which has came out to be good i would say this is a shot of a small light over there and this is another shot which is looking nice again the photos may not look that bright but they are looking good in terms of the colors which is much more important and clarity is also very good on this device as far as the rear camera is concerned as far as front camera is concerned let me take a photo right now in front of you and show you the quality of the same uh, when it comes to the front camera so let me talk to the front camera and take a selfie again this one has also been taken in low light and this is the kind of clarity you can expect from the front camera i would say the camera is doing a good job overall which is something which i really like they have improved the camera interface as well as the camera optics this time which is good and again you also have the fingerprint sensor which is provided on this one so that you can unlock the phone using the fingerprint sensor and they have nexus imprint as the settings name for the fingerprint sensor inside the device 